What is up guys, welcome back to another FIFA 22 Ultimate Team video. So today, I'm going to be showing you how to complete Future Stars Chuck Woozy. If you're looking to buy some cheap FIFA 22 Ultimate Team coins, make sure you check out U7 Buy. The transactions are safe and you'll receive your coins within the blink of an eye. Make sure you use code K at the checkout for 5% off. The link is in the description. Also guys, if you're looking to accessorize your controller and give it a new and improved look, then check out Fatal Grips. They do joystick grips and controller skins that look and feel amazing. The grips and skins come in an array of different colors and styles to choose from. And use the code KN10 to get 10% off at the checkout and the link will be in the description. All right then, today is Friday. Team 2 is finally out and EA have released two uh, playable foot future stars players now the first one is chuck woozy and the second one i will get into which is a french striker um so four objectives here Fu first one future hope score finesse goal using a midfielder in two separate matches in the life of friendly liga uh oh la liga lights now i'll quickly show you what the requirements are for that life of friendly mode um hopefully it's not too hard or difficult to actually put together so uh, la liga light is you need exactly 18 uh, La Liga Santander players. So I think that's the first 11 the reserves. And so you literally, I think you need reserves for this, if I'm not mistaken. Or I think it's just, it could be um, substitutions or subs bench. Um, and just the starting 11. I don't know how many you allowed on the bench. But, it, you know, you could possibly have to have a team of reserves. I, I, don't, I don't know if that's um, how it should be anyway, but... I definitely know it's the start in 11 and bench, um, but I'm not too sure on how much you need on the bench. Uh, loan players, max one. First owner players, min five. Really simple here. Um, so everyone's going to be like, you know, similar, but um, in a way, because obviously you can just buy players on the market, but they've done the first owner thing, which is quite good to be fair. Uh, second objective, assist four goals with through balls in the left of friendly La Liga lights. Um, just assisting with through balls. It's not really hard because everyone does this now anyway. Uh, third one, win four matches in the life of friendly La Liga lights. Simple. Um, and the last one, score in 10 separate matches using La Liga players. Again, it's not going to be hard because the goals you, you're only going to score or be able to score is with La Liga players. So all you've got to do is score at least one goal in 10 separate matches. Win four of those 10 separate matches. Uh, get uh, four assists with through balls. In one match, if you want, it's up to you. And score a finesse goal in two separate matches with a midfielder. Now, what I would say is use cams at either center forward, or you can just move them in like in game. That's left mids, right mids, center mids, CDMs, or cams. Um, those are the players that you want to score finesse goals with in two separate matches. Uh, you get a couple of decent packs, and I'll quickly show you um, his in game stats before I obviously go on to the next player, which will probably be in another video. So, if I can quickly show you, it is a, um, a Future Stars. I'm pretty sure he's been on the game for ages, so I thought he was quite old. Um, where it is, La Liga Santa Dare. He is, I think he's 89, 88 rated, something like that. Where is he? I think he's 88 rated then. Oh, there he is. Top right, Chuck Woozy. I think that's how you pronounce his name. I could be mistaken. Uh, left foot, which is quite good for a right uh, a right mid anyway, because you can cut in. 5 foot 8, that's very good. High low. Uh, 4 star, 4 star, that's brilliant. And his in-game stats are pretty good. His pace is obviously quite high. Shooting's decent. It's not bad for a winger, to be fair. Uh, passing's not bad as well. Dribbling's really good. And so his his physicals. I'll probably say a hawk on him, just to upgrade his uh, pass shooting and physicals, because those are the only ones really for a winger. That you need upgrading. Dribbling's already high up, so you don't really need. I mean, unless you want to upgrade reactions, you can't upgrade a, a composure. It's not low, but it's it's decent enough um, for uh, this time in the game. Anyway, so 88 rated there. That is going to be the end of the video, guys. Hopefully, you found this helpful. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you are new to the channel, and I will see you guys in the next video.